our taxi is here. This is the size of the taxi, by the way, guys, and I love it. I barely fit in it because I'm so tall. Here we go, on to our first spot. Hello, namaste. We made it into the car. The first place where we are going is called Swoyambu Temple. This is a place that we saw the first day. We're super interested of going there because it is located very high up a mountain. So we have to walk a lot of stairs. I am excited for this. And as you can see, the sun is already slowly setting. So we are in a little bit of a rush. All the monkeys are nodding. Oh, whoa, the monkeys here are huge. Look at all the monkeys. A lot of monkeys, lots of sellers here. I see lots of people selling food as well and a lot of tourists but the view oh my god i can't wait to show you guys the view we made it to the entrance and we are going to walk up right now we don't have to walk the stairs so that is perfect we have like a little shortcut and now let's see first how much it is actually to enter so it's 200 per ticket per person, which is, I think, around 1 year, 120 cents, something like that. Thank you. We just entered. There are a lot of people going on. There are a lot of monkeys. Maybe you can hear them already. They're fighting. It's crazy. Here are a lot of people standing around the round thing. And monkeys again, which I love. And everyone is trying to throw money into the round pot here. I think it's probably for good luck as well. I can only imagine how much money there must be into this fountain. I found also the place where they sell monkey food, but I'm not gonna get that because I don't want the monkeys too close. And here, what I was just selling, you can buy the coins. You buy here, and you're going here, you can here. I don't like monkeys that much. Scared, we are scared yes. for the monkeys. But how much is this? This is 10 rupees for eight. Okay, and then if we throw it in the bowl, it's good luck. Okay, let's do it. What's your name? Nima. Nima. Wow, I like that name. Oh, hello. <laughs> She's so cute. Hello. <laughs> Ten, right? There you go. I got the coins and then we can throw it in. Thank you. I'm gonna try to get my good luck right now. Yeah. Look, everyone is throwing here. It's crazy. I feel a lot of pressure right now to get good luck. But here we go. This is the first coin. Okay, that one was completely wrong, completely off. There was actually someone here laughing at me. One more. Ooh, this one was close. I tried it already, I failed. You failed, so you I have, try it again. I try again. So I have these two and I gave three to Wishnu. So let's see. I missed. No, <laughs> no. I missed, I missed. Did you do all of them? All of them and I gave three to Wishnu. So I am not getting any good luck. No wishes for you. No wishes for me. <laughs> One more. I have two. Oh, almost, almost. No, no, no good luck. <laughs> We're both unlucky. I have three coins. <laughs> Fail. Here we see all the monkeys. Look, there are so many of them. It's crazy. Wow, I can't believe it. Oh, no. oh the small one is coming. Oh, they're huge. Wow. This is literally what I imagined Nepal would be like. There are a lot of shops at both sides. So many nice things to buy. A lot of sellers as well. The sun is slowly setting, which makes it even more perfect. We have the beautiful musicians here. Oh, there's wow. even water. Crazy. Thank you. Wow, that was really cool. But we have a mission. We are going up right now. We cannot be distracted with all the sellers. And what I also really like is all the flags with the prayers. They're all in the trees. So beautiful. Look here how high it is. We made it to the top. This is truly magical. Right now, I am standing where the temple is, it's like the mid square. It is so beautiful. There is a lot of gold layers as well, and all the flags here, truly breathtaking. Very busy it is. And you can see that actually a lot of people here are walking clockwise again. They're doing this for good luck, and then they turn this. Really, really epic to see. And then this is the view. It is so, we are so high up. It is also windy. 
but the view is so worth it. A lot of people are also just sitting here chilling and just enjoying the view, not doing anything. Wow. The fun thing is we even see the mountain peaks in the backdrop here and there is snow on top of the mountains. Living in Indonesia, I haven't seen this for a long, long time. So this is definitely super special. Look at all the monkeys here sitting behind me. And then here you have the beautiful stupa. There are dogs here as well, a lot of people. And it's actually way bigger than I thought it was. And here you can also see how high up this place is. I can't believe how huge it is. And there you can see even the monkey climbing in the house. They're so naughty, the little monkeys. And there are a lot of shops with really good souvenirs. All of this again, it's so beautiful. of it i love it it's pretty overwhelming but it's so beautiful yeah and the sun is already under so exactly but that adds a beautiful extra light to it you yes see the moon. oh my god it's so so beautiful there's now a monkey on top here you see the moon you see the clouds it is perfect i love the time that we came here yeah it's beautiful it's a really beautiful experience a lot of people come here though and so many things are happening and there are monkeys yes. everywhere everywhere the monkeys don't fight with humans they only fight with other monkeys you so can we hear are them. safe yes we are safe sort of I'm still scared. I know. <laughs> I'm also very aware of the monkeys all the time. And a lot of people are praying. It is stunning. Really nice and serene place. Okay, a monkey just peed on me. So I'm gonna ask for a little tissue. Hello. Do you maybe have a little tissue? This was wild. It never happened to me before. I mean, thank you so much. I was walking yeah. alongside a roof and then I think I saw water, but I didn't really understand that it was pee. The monkey just completely sprayed on me. This is wild. I never had this happen to me before. Can I see? Okay, wait. I don't know. You can see it like the yellow drops. So they touched you? No, it was like on there. And then I saw water coming, but I couldn't really understand it. So I was like, oh, it's water. And then I saw the monkey. Oh it's my God. wild. So I didn't got good luck with the coins, but a monkey peed on me. Is that good luck? I think it's bad luck. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, crazy. I never had this happen to me before. Do you smell it? Uh, no, no. <laughs> the monkeys won't attack me. <laughs> Next step is to throw this monkey pee away and then I will be good again. I will be fresh. This is crazy. What an experience. Go to a temple in Nepal. It will be fun, they said. In the meantime, I have monkey pee everywhere. I hope I'm not gonna stink now, but let's see. Okay, here I found a trash bin. So here we go. <laughs> so on to the next adventure, being peed on. Check. Now let's see what's gonna happen next. We are leaving, the sun has set, it is slowly getting dark and it's actually getting really cold. Good morning, it is currently the next day and it is 8 a.m. in the morning. It is super early. We just arrived at Chandragiri Gable Car and we are going up a mountain with a cable car and there is a beautiful temple as well to be seen we are now gonna see how much the tickets are and how we can enter and then up into the cable car we go because we arrived so early there is so much fog still over the city it is truly a magnificent view and we see snowy mountain tops in the far distance as well this place is so magical but as you can see it is a little bit cold that's why i have my jacket on but it is perfection this morning. Here we have the ticket station. Let's see how much we have to pay. How much in rupees? Per person, 2925. This much. Can we pay by card? Okay, sure, ma'am. The ticket is 1775 rupees. Okay, I'll pay Yeah. Sugar mommy in the house. <laughs> What's your name? Isma. Oh, Isma. Oh, I love the names here. Okay, we are entering. So excited. Okay, thank you. I love cable cars so much. It's been such a long time since I last been in one. Let's see how it goes. They're red, tiny little cable cars. So excited. Here we go. Okay, it's still moving. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, here we are. 
I love this. Okay. Hello, love welcome girl. to the party. <laughs> it would be a short ride we are still going guys it is crazy we are still going high up and i think we're almost there you can see it maybe in the end but this is crazy we're also seeing beautiful high snowy mountain peaks wow how do you like it janine <laughs> i love it so much it's you a little it? bit scary it's a little bit scary but it's beautiful Wow. Wow, it's going even further. Yeah, we're going so high. I think this is definitely like a 10 or 15 <gasps> minutes cable ride. Look you at the see mountains. the mountains? I didn't see that. The mountains, I know. I wonder which mountains these are. Wow. <gasps> Okay, I go. I love it. Okay, we made it to the top. Let's see how it is here. It's cold already. That's what I can see. Oh, wow. Oh, my this God. Is this is incredible. <laughs> I'm never so excited anymore, but this is one of the most beautiful things I've seen in a very, very, very long time. There are literally layers of mountains. This is crazy. You have the hill here, then you have a huge mountain range behind it. And then after that, there are the snowy peak tops of the biggest, highest mountains of Nepal. This is truly incredible. What an experience. This is incredible. I don't even know what to say anymore. This is wild. I can't believe it. We just found out that there's an app called Peak Pfizer. You can download it and then you can see which mountains are where and how high they are. Janine is downloading it right now and you can see all the peaks in the sun. It's truly gorgeous. And I think actually the one that we see in the back here is called Lang Tan. There you can see Lang Tan Mountain. It's one of the highest. So what I just realized is we are at an altitude of 2,551 meters. That is truly epic. We are very high up already. And that also explains why it's getting colder now. Because it is still so early in the morning, we decided we're gonna have breakfast here. We ordered again the chicken momo because we love it so much. And here you can see them cooking already. I love it. That it's like an open kitchen. It's so nice. And we're gonna wait and then enjoy our breakfast with a view at the mountaintops. We have such a gorgeous table. Whoa, I didn't expect this. Guys, this is the best momo I've had up until now. I love the steamed and I love the chicken and the sauce. Oh, whoa. Wow. 10 out of 10. Mm. Amazing. Right now, after good food, it is time to go zip lining. This looks so, so incredible. And I'm really excited for it. Thank you. We show this there. Yes. Okay, long zip line is important. That's the highest. Yeah. We have our tickets. Here is the entrance of the zip line. It is the highest zip line in Kathmandu, an altitude of 2,551 meters. Wow, I didn't know. <laughs> so cool. Look here. Okay, wow, look at the mountains. This is crazy. Here we go up, and then I guess we have to show our ticket. Hello. Two in total, but this is for one. Oh my god, so beautiful. Okay. Amazing! Look at this view, this is incredible! Whoa. Look at this view from here guys, it is crazy! I don't think I've ever been so high up that you can literally see the entire city! This is wild and we're even higher than the clouds because you can see it there. So stunning, wow, and so huge! time to go back and it is Janine her turn. I'm so excited what she's gonna think of it. 
it is time to go down again and look how busy it is we came here really on time and now it is getting super crowded already which is so interesting to see so if you come make sure to come on time and we can go in the cable car again which makes me so happy i love this hello how are you i'm fine yay can i go yeah okay oh, 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 oh. there we go Woo. This is literally, I love it so much because the views are incredible. Now that it's a little bit later, it is really epic because you can see the city even more clear. So stunning. This is so steep. Oh, oh, my God. oh this is crazy. I even, I feel it in my ears. They're popping. Wow, that's scary. <laughs> I can't believe how high up we are. down in the crowd crazy how busy it is can't believe it and right now we're gonna find a car and move on to our next spot but first we have to find what you do from the taxi we went straight to lunch where we are right now and i ordered a curry because i love it here so much we are in the cutest restaurant again the vibe here is absolutely amazing we're gonna dig in now before we go off to our next temple we are on the way to pasu Pan okay, we are all the way to Pasu Patina Temple and we are going to witness a really, really special ceremony here. I can't wait for it because we got recommended so many times that we needed to go here and right now we're on our way. So excited. So apparently we are not allowed in the temple. So right now we are looking YouTube videos and seeing where we can stand to see the ritual happening. It's gonna be a big surprise. It looks very promising. I'm scared. <laughs> You're scared? Yeah. <laughs> We made it, we just arrived. Thank you so much, sir. Bye. It's very busy here, lots of people. There's also music already going on. And I don't see any tourists, which is interesting to me. Hello. Lots of smiling faces, which is good, I like that. That's a beautiful entrance ticket that I have here. It's really big. Pasupatinat Temple, Kathmandu, Nepal. We're gonna find a good spot right now. There's lots of things happening tonight. I'm really excited for it. We have to find a good spot first. Thank you. Thank you. So now that we found a quiet spot, we are waiting for the show to happen. It is time to give you some background information of this place. So this temple is a Hindu temple dedicated to Pasupati, which is a form of Shiva. It is here located in Kathmandu, Nepal, near the Bagmati River. And this temple is also classified as a World Heritage Site. It's crazy because it includes 518 mini temples and not Hindu people are not allowed inside, which makes sense. That's why a lot of people, as you can see, are sitting here. And a lot of times at 6.30 p.m. the Aarti ceremony starts and that is what we are going to witness right now. So what is really interesting about the open cremation here is that it's believed that a cremation at this site grants moksha, which is liberation from the cycle of rebirth. So we arrive now at the part where they do the burning. It's 24 hours today, so they're burning the whole day. Always. It's really interesting to see, always. Yeah. It's always burning here. They even said it's like the biggest open air cremation of, Na this, of Nepal. Kathmandu, yeah, of Nepal. Nepal. Crazy. And there are so yeah. many places where they do the burning. There's one going on right now. You don't see the body. You see everything like that's on top of there, which they're burning. It's crazy to see. We just walked to the other side because there we were a little bit too close to the burning body. So we don't want to inhale the smoke. It feels a bit weird. Hello. <laughs> so right now we're walking to here and I'm gonna try to get a close-up video for you guys. This is such a special experience to witness here because I feel like this is not something that you can see in Europe. Like in entire Europe you would not be able to see something like this and here it is completely normal they do it 24 hours a day everyone is standing next to it they're all observing it tourists are watching here you can see like a lot of people are here watching at the sideline 
and it's special. There are monkeys and there's so much smoke coming off. It's crazy to see. Here you can actually see how much smoke is coming off. It's all blowing our direction. And there's actually a sunset happening right now at the moment. It's a very special moment, wow. out of there this was so crowded we are now walking to our taxi Janine is ordering one it was so crowded we saw only half of the show we actually left earlier than we expected because it was too crowded for us we're both not really fan of a lot of people in one place so that's why we're leaving already <laughs> Hello. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Wow, this is the party? For who yeah, is party. it? Who? Who do you have? Yeah. Which order? What's the name? I don't know his name. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's always a big tip. If the driver doesn't want to say who the booking is for, do not get into the car. Because you need to see if the booking is for you. Otherwise, it can just be a random driver which you cannot trust. So we made a new booking. He's gonna be here hopefully soon. And we're waiting at this really nice shop with this gorgeous girl here. <laughs> it's so nice to be waiting here. How long is it now? Is your first time in Nepal? First time in Nepal. Wow. Yes. Like we are Nepal? at the picker point. We love it. Really like it. We love the people so much. We love the food and the shopping. It's really nice. And are you from Kathmandu? Yeah, we are local. You're we local? Are, yeah. We got a chair. We're part of you now. Yes, we're part of the shop now. <laughs> it's Can actually really it? nice. It's really nice to sit here. Now you are also seller. Yes, <laughs> we're sellers. What what do we need to sell? Everything. Everything, whatever you want. Okay. Cheap price. <laughs> That's how we do it in Indonesia. Only five thousand. Five thousand. Who wants? Thank you so much. You made us feel so safe. <laughs> Have a good evening. So nice to meet you. Bye. Bye. Second try to get a cap. How are you? I'm good. And you? Very good as well. We're happy to be back home here. <laughs> okay, guys, we are back at our hotel where we are staying. This was such an adventure today. I really liked all the temples that we visited, but for me, definitely the must visit temple is the second one with the cable card up. This was such an epic adventure. I really, really liked it. So let me know which one is your favorite. If you want to see more of my Nepal adventures, please do not forget to like and subscribe because there are so many more coming. So thank you for watching and as always, I'll see you in my next one.